name is Helen Eos, and I was harassed by the principal of my school because of this shirt. Okay, so I went to class just like any regular school day. I had the shirt on, and no one was offended or anything by it. Then my teacher, Mr. Young, says, Ms. Schaffner wants to see you. I walk over to her in the hall, and she was talking to some, uh, some teachers with one or two students walking around her. I can't remember. She stops talking to them when she sees me, pulls me over to a corner, and says plainly, you can't wear the shirt. Wow. Five minutes into the day, and I've been caught. Shoot. I say very politely, may I go get something from my locker? And she says, yeah. So I head on down to my locker to get a piece of paper. It's a magical piece of paper that gets me out of trouble. From the American Knife League. Actually, no. It states my civil rights and how I can wear the shirt. No harassment. I hand over the letter and she hands me a shirt with the school name on it. Oh joy. So, I head to the bathroom to change and I hear her say, we are going to have to talk to the principal about this one. So, there I am, in the principal's office. Miss Annan, the principal, reads the letter, and Miss Schaffner is babbling on about how they've never had this happen before, while, of course, Miss Annan is reading. Miss Schaffner gets called away to do vice principal stuff, and Miss Annan pulls up a chair beside me and asks, How do you know about this political issue? My mom, I say. What would you think if a kindergartner went up to you and asked you what it is? She says, pointing at my shirt. I would say it's where doctors and hospitals kill babies. You should have seen her face when I said that. <sighs> I just don't want you to be uncomfortable, she says. So she leads me to a bathroom. You can turn it inside out or you can change, whichever you want. So I change into the t-shirt with the school name on it so they would be happy and quit bothering me. Okay, so this is how it was in the classroom. Why'd you change your t-shirt, they ask. They made me, which I say is not stretching the truth. So we go to art and my teacher came in the middle of it and said, walk with me. So I walk with him and he says, you can change into your shirt now or after art. Which do you want? Changed after lunch. Okay, so can you believe this? The principal of an elementary school pressured and manipulated a fifth grade student to do her wills. The principal of all people.